Hey there, it's Sherry Smotherman Short from Painless Blog Analytics, and I wanted to do a really quick video to show you how to add Google uh, the Google Analytics 4 or GA4 property to your um, regular analytics account. Now, one thing to note is that you it is important to go ahead and install GA4 on your site, but you do not want to delete Universal Analytics. It, it can They can run together and it will not cause any kind of duplicate um, re, um, counting of your page views or anything like that. So it's uh, fairly easy to do. So what we're going to do is, um, and I've picked a, a blog that I have that has one post on it, um, and I'm going to make sure that I add the, the GA4 to this. So what we need to do is click admin and then make sure you're in the right account here and you can do that by just clicking on the down arrow uh, screen or I'm sorry the down arrow button and then if you're in the right account which the first thing you want to do is you want to click here to make sure that you don't have a GA4 um, property already set up so I don't have so all I need to do is click this GA4 setup assistant and then it's going to ask me if I want to connect a property or create a new one. And we're going to create a new one. So get started. And then um, this is our little setup wizard. And it's telling us all the things that it's going to do. And um, it's going to say, you know, do we want to enable the data collection using our existing tags? And we do. So we're going to click Create Property. And now it's connected. And so we're going to click this button here to just see our GA4 property. And it tells me that this is the new account, that it's connected, and everything should be fine. But what we want to do is we're in the GA4 property, so let's just click Home. You may see this no data received message and that's because it takes up to 30 minutes for our information from GA4 to start showing up here in our analytics account. So give it about half an hour, maybe 45 minutes and come back and check. 